Welcome to Watermelon Channel. In today's video, we present to you amazing celebrity bodyguards and security teams that nobody wants to mess with. Before we start, make sure to subscribe to our channel so you can get even more awesome videos. Let's get started. Rihanna's bodyguard has been seen protecting her everywhere she goes, but couldn't save her from getting slammed by a door. And although another bodyguard gives her the superstar treatment, he also forgets to hold the door for his boss. <laughs> We're just going through anything. <laughs> That's how it is. Yup. Like, you did it? I need footage of that. With Chris Brown's constantly growing list of violence and assault accusations, the singer needs a large group of security guards, making sure none of the victims get their revenge. Any great company's biggest asset is its people, and no one is more important than the CEO. In 2021, Meta spent $27 million on Mark Zuckerberg's security, including 16 of his bodyguards. For comparison, other Silicon Valley giants spent $46 million combined to safeguard their top brass that year. For several years, two model-looking bodyguards have been keeping Daniel Radcliffe safe from hordes of screaming Harry Potter fans. Even Voldemort himself wouldn't dare to fight those muscles. Apart from protecting their boss at all costs and getting him through a sea of fans, Johnny Depp's bodyguards have another very important duty, pulling the star away from admirers of his talent when he gets too involved. Despite Post Malone's bodyguards looking very intimidating, it didn't stop his diehard fan from sneaking through the security to hug his idol. Though personal assistant to Carl Lagerfeld might roughly describe Sebastian John Doe's job title for over two decades, his services in fact went far deeper. Sebastian was a model, bodyguard, personal chauffeur, and most importantly, an unwavering source of emotional support to one of fashion's most iconic figures. John Doe has a passion for boxing and does a lot of other sports to keep in shape. One of the big downsides of mega fame is not being able to go out on your own. Bieber became famous when he was still a teenager, and he's had plenty of bodyguards who have protected him from fans. While Justin has calmed down since he got married, he was always making waves during his heyday, which meant his bodyguards had to be ready for anything. <laughs> Who is that? 
Justin, congratulations on a new album, man. Sorry, guys. Excuse us. Taylor Swift spends around $400,000 a year on security, thanks to her best-selling albums, constant media exposure, and her army of crazy fans. Even such a high price seems like a steal. Taylor has two bodyguards that keep to her heels and to make sure the star stays safe. This includes doing things like sitting in the back of a roller coaster. Even if you don't like that, a couple hundred thousand dollars a year should make up for it. Down, 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 go down, go down. There you go. <laughs> Pascal Duvier accompanied Kim Kardashian to most events, including Kanye's concerts, fashion weeks, red carpet appearances, and extravagant vacations around the world. Pascal is a former German military and judo expert. He also runs his own security company with partners around the world. After the incident in Paris, where Kim was held at gunpoint and robbed in a private apartment, they parted ways. Just a few days before the heist, Duvier and Kardashian were in the spotlight when Pascal tackled a celebrity prankster after he accosted Kardashian on her way into a restaurant. These bodyguards must be feeling really safe, as they are protected by Rambo himself. The most memorable of Sly's bodyguards is a professional Puerto Rican bodybuilder, Rudy Hermosillo. Despite being 5'4", Rudy deserves Stallone's trust and worked for Sly in the 1980s. Did you like those photographs that were everywhere? Oh, excuse me. <laughs> it doesn't like your t-shirt. Can I take a picture of it? Julius Debor can be spotted at all of Beyonce's outings, moving paparazzi out of the way or shielding her from the flash of photos since 2008. The bodyguard, who knows five languages and has a psychology degree, was raised in Amsterdam and started his own executive protection company in Europe at the age of 24. Julius is tall, laser-focused, and not someone to mess around with. Floyd Mayweather might be superbly skilled in the ring, but outside of it, he needs to take some precautions. Floyd has a whole entourage of giant bodyguards, with the biggest one towering over him at 7 foot 1. The ostentatious boxer always travels with a bag of cash, and thus, so-called money team has to be responsible enough to handle large amounts of money. Bollywood superstar Salman Khan and his bodyguard Shira have been inseparable for 27 years, ever since they met at Keanu Reeves' party. Now they are very close friends, and Salman even dedicated to his bodyguard an eponymous movie, giving him a special role in the film. Before working as security and opening his own security company, Shira was famously fond of bodybuilding and even won a few contests.
Takashi69 has been talking reckless since he came out of the gate with Gummo, so it doesn't come as much of a surprise that he rolls around with heavy security. And after he was tackled on stage during a concert, Takashi recruited two former members of Floyd Mayweather's security team to protect him from potential harm. Thank you for watching our video. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it, and see you in the next one.